smoky I what I was really doing is I don't know I was just decided to do my makeup because I'm feeling like really like under the weather so I thought let me just beat my face so I thought it would be nice to do like let me beat my face slash get ready with me slash going from basic to hat down slash yeah I'll just remove the slash and just leave it at that makeup tutorial so hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you guys next time bye Hey guys, so let's get started. Firstly, I'm going to be applying my Smashbox Photo Finishing Primer and I'm just gonna be applying a small um, dot onto my hand and then I'm going to be applying that all over my face. So you just you just like need the smallest bit, you don't actually need that much primer or makeup will be that really patchy. So just make sure you just get it everywhere that you're gonna be doing makeup. I've already done my eyebrows because um, from someone like me who like, I don't know how to do eyebrows that well. Like I'm still learning, so you gonna skip that bit. So next I'm gonna be going into my Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation and I'm in the color Y535. And I'm just gonna be pumping like three squirts onto this foundation. This foundation is the perfect match for me. I know I look oily right now, but it's gonna dry. What the broke my nail. So just to um, even up my face, I'm going to be using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the colour NW45. Just underneath my eyes, around my mouth as well. This just allows you to have like a much more fuller coverage. And then I'm going to be using um, NW Concealer again, but I'm going to be using a lighter colour just to create a more brighter effect underneath the eye. And I'm using it in the colour, I think it's NW40. I don't think I've changed. Oh my gosh, I'm actually running out. Please, no. So yeah, just put it on highlighted areas. So I just applied on my nose, here on my cupid's bow, and then on my chin. Then of course, you're gonna be going in with a damp beauty blender. You guys know how I feel if you don't, like I like to soak my beauty blender and then I like to take out all the moisture. Like I don't understand people who use a hard beauty blender like, it's not gonna blend out anything, so I'm just gonna blend this out with my beauty blender. You can leave your highlighter like this. I actually like a brighter under eye. I know I am team too much, but it's just not the same. And I'm gonna be going in with the Maybelline Instant Anti Eraser in the color Nude. I'm going to be going into my Sasha Buttercup um, Setting Powder. And I'm just going to be going in with the same beauty blender and I'm just going to be applying that underneath my eyes. Guys, when I tell you, yeah, I've actually like slightly forgotten how to do makeup because when I go to, when I go to uni, like I actually don't wear makeup, like I actually don't have a tramp, I'm not going to lie to you. And especially when I have 9am's, I ain't got time to be doing a full face beat. So yeah, I'm just about making the lecture, the class. So I think if you guys saw me, you'll just be like, damn, she really don't care. <laughs> I'm just gonna be applying just a thin layer of uh, Sasha Buttercup because um, I just don't want any of the fallout or any of the eyeshadow to go onto, onto my under eye. I'm gonna be going into my Z palette, yes! First color that I'm going to be going into is Morocco by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And it's like a orange, like a burnt orange color. And I'm just gonna be applying that as my transitional color. So we're just gonna be sweeping that back and forth you guys know I'm all about that blending life, so just make sure it's all blended out. And I'm just sweeping that all the way in. Then next, I'm going into Anastasia Beverly Hills Sienna. So I think as a transitional colour, I've just mixed Sienna and Morocco. So next, I'm going to be using a the NYX Jumbo Pencil in the colour Black. Just have it, just concentrate so that it's just on the lid. You don't want it any, you don't want to bring it any higher. So now I'm going to go in with fudge into my crease and don't go too far up, just go into your crease. And then I'm just gonna be going into a flat shader brush and I'm just gonna be applying 
fudge onto my lid which is the exact same color for the outer crease i'm gonna be going in with beauty mark which is like a really nice dark chocolatey brown and i'm just gonna be putting that on the outer v so next i'm gonna be going into my mac mineralized skin finish in the color dark deep and i'm just gonna be using that to wipe off the excess underneath my eyes so i'm gonna be firstly using sienna and i'm gonna be sweeping that underneath my eye i'm going to be going in with a darker color fudge and then just in the outer V, I'm going to be using Beauty Mark. Going all the way in with my inner, just here in the V. I'm going in with my Black Opal Foundation Stick and I'm going to be using that as contour. <laughs> Why am I so tongue-tied today? And the colour that I'm using is Suede Mocha. And I'm just going to be blending that out. And I'm just going to be setting underneath my cheeks and I'm going to be going in with my Sasha Buttercup. Then I'm going to be going into the Sleep Contour Kit. Then I'm going to be going into the L'Oreal Invaluable Pro Matte. And I'm just going to be using that to wipe off the excess powder. Then we're going to be going on to bronzing and I'm going in with the Covergirl Ebony Bronzer. And I'm just going to be applying that all around my face and I'm going to be using that to contour my nose and because I've got quite like smoky eyes I'm going quite neutral with the blush and I'm going to be using the color coral which is like a pink orange blush oh, I love this blush back to the eyes and I'm going into my L'Oreal liner I'm going to be going in with my Lash Sensational Maybelline Mascara. The lashes that I'm going to be using today are the Lily Lashes in the style Diamond. Now let's move on to highlighting. So next I'm going to be going into my MAC, I don't know what it's called, MAC Extra Diminish Finishing. Let's just call it a highlighter because that's what it pretty much is. And then on top of that, I'm going to go in with Oh Darling by MAC and it is a highlighter. I do want to put just a tiny bit on my brow bone because I just want to pop in all areas. On my lips, I'm going to be using Bitten by MAC. I'm going to be going into with Lolita. And I'm going to go in with the NYX Butter Gloss in the colour Madeline. Oh, that smells so good. Next, I'm going to be setting my face. And that is with the Revolution... Re Revolu Revolution Oil Fix... Fixing Spray. So this is pretty much the finished look. I don't know if you guys can see, it's a really nice brown smoky eye. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial and don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, follow the Solan Eye on all our social media accounts so you can talk with us. And yeah, I think that's it. I don't think I've left anything out. Yeah, that's pretty much it. So I'll see you guys, bye.